Hi, today we're at Crane Beach in Ipswich, Massachusetts, and boy is it a beautiful beach. It's actually the first time I've ever been here, and I am surprised at how many seashells there are. It is like beachcombers heaven. So look down with me and you'll see some very typical shells of Massachusetts beaches. You can see, everywhere we went, the entire walk was covered with these huge surf clams. These big clams are bivalves. They have two halves to their shell to protect the mollusk within the clam. And they're, they are big. We found even bigger ones. So surf clams, little surf clams. Found some oysters, a bunch of pieces of oysters. And then we found a lot of black clams. They're also called false cohogs. So you know they're not a cohog because they don't have that blue inside. And if you find them with this black periostracum, which is just the covering on the shell, then, you, you know, you, it's uh, easy to identify these big black clams. But they're round like the quahog. See how round they are? Compared to the surf clam, which is more oblong. Now, if you come over here, this looks like another little surf clam. And these two here are soft shell clams. Soft shell clams. And I believe this is the chestnut astarte, which we found a bunch of those just north of here on Plum Island. I think it was last year or the year before. We found a ton of pieces of sand dollars. Big ones, too. Really nice, healthy looking sand dollars. And we also have some jackknife clams. Okay, the big long jackknife clams. And if you look over here, I got a couple of special things. First of all, we found a bunch of um, moon snails, which have one shell. The snails have one shell. So the clams, two shells, bivalves and the snails one shell they're also called univalves okay so you can see all of these right these are all moon snails here's the top of a moon snail and this one i found in the surf and i don't know if he's doing too well but if you look underneath you can see this is his trap door called the operculum and you can see a little bit of the flesh of the animal i'm going to put him right back in the surf just in case he's going to make it but i'm not sure and I found a couple of little dog whelks there. And then this little piece, this looks like a baby sea scallop. Looks like a baby sea scallop. And I found some here in this area, Newburyport, Plum Island. You find those. And if you come down here, you can see I've got a lot of nice driftwood. And we found the carapace of a crab. And over here, blue mussels. Found a bunch of blue mussels. And then here is the jackpot of the day. This is a real find to me. Look at all these angel wings. I have never found these many false angel wings on one beach ever. So this to me is absolutely amazing and they're beautiful and they're in great shape. And I even found a couple of pieces of this and this is the actual angel wing. Not the false, but the angel wing. See, it kind of sweeps around and they have a piece of shell there. It's also called the Piddock Shell. So, a gorgeous beach for a nice long walk. Lots of people out here today. It's the end of February. It's over 50 degrees. Couldn't ask for a nicer day. So great to be back at the beach. Hope to see you again soon. Enjoy the view.